Hello, my amazing artists. Do you want to learn how to make this effect while painting? Well, follow this video. You will need some watercolor paint, so a cup with some water and a paintbrush. And now you're going to wake up the paint and just put a little dot of the paint. Now, the more dots you, the more paint you have, the better this might work. So I'm simply just getting, loading that brush and then dotting the paint onto my paper. So it still is kind of like a bubble of the paint. Can you see that? Then I take a straw and I'm literally going to get down on the level of my paper and I'm going to blow air to move that paint. Wow, look at that. Now, every time you do it, it might look a little different. So this is all about experimenting. The more water and the more paint you have, the more you'll have to work with. And you can try rotating the paper like I am to get the paint to travel in different directions. Like I said, the more water and the more paint you have, the more the paint can move. If you notice that it's not really moving, you might need to load up your brush with more paint and try to put a little blob that has some more water and more paint before you try to um, blow it with air with through the straw. Now, what I love about this is that it's just random. You don't really know where it's gonna go. You can try to lead it down, but it might change its mind and that is okay. This is a super fun strategy. So I hope that you give it a try. And remember, this is a tool to help us. This is not a toy. Now let's watch another student do this. Thanks. Great. I'm going to make a rainbow. I want this to go really far. Yeah, so you got to keep pushing. How fun, right? So I hope you give this a try, and I cannot wait to see what you create.